Hi everyone, Sue here from 1A Auto, and today on our 2013 Toyota Camry, I'm going to show you how to remove and then replace the undercarriage splash shields. If you need any parts of your car, click on the link below and head on over to 1AAuto.com. To take the undercarriage shield down, we're going to need a 10 millimeter socket and a body clip tool. Uh, this car has had the shield down, somebody replaced. So for the most part, it should be a 10 millimeter socket, but this one someone put in. They are actually standard 13 or half inch socket, so I'm just going to take them down. Switch over to the 10. So you're going to do the same per side. So there's those three bolts with that little rubber vent, just directs the airflow. You're going to take those down, and then you're going to have one, two, three, four across the front, and then one body clip. I'm going to do the body clip. R for right side, passenger side. And the L for left side, drive. When I put the shield back up, I've got the R for right side, which would be the passenger side. You can see the cutout of the fender well right here. So I'm going to guide it in. So you want the tab from the bumper underneath and you want to put all these little flares up under like that. So I'm going to put one bolt in and hold it. And then I'm going to go over here and I've got my fender guide here. So that's going to go on top there, then that one. Now this has that rubber piece, remember? I'm going to get my electric gun with my 10 millimeter socket. Let's tie it on here. I'm going to do the same on the driver's side, which is the plastic that says L. So that's going to go overlap up inside. And the one time, the one piece I put on, <laughs> the one bolt I tighten up, of course, like that, up inside the fender flare. There we go. So now I can take my rubber piece here, put that up. Let me make sure I line that up. This one that overlaps, so this piece is going to go down underneath it. And then we have a push pin that I'm going to put in right here. And then the last one is a replacement push pin. Right Thanks there. for watching. Visit 1AAuto.com for quality auto parts shipped to your door, the place for DIY auto repair. And if you enjoyed this video, please click the subscribe button.